I'm Suzanne Miller. I'm Colin's mom, and I believe in miracles. It might seem crazy what I'm about to say. I found out when I was 18 weeks pregnant that Colin was going to be born with spina bifida. Spina bifida is a birth defect in Colin's. His is the most severe. It's called myelomeningocele, and it's where the when he was developing in utero, his spine did not fully close and there's lots of nerve damage it's hard to receive a diagnosis like that because doctors are trained to give you worst case scenario he may never walk he may have developmental delays it's just a it's a crushing blow because you have to mourn the the perfect baby that you thought you were going to have and start preparing for a baby that's going to have some special needs here come bad news talking this and that He was so nonverbal when we started speech therapy that they had started just trying to get him to say vowel sounds. He was nonverbal when we started, and now he can say sentences and he's starting to read. Colin loves to go to school. Like, he loves to read, he loves recess, he's, he's very social. My biggest fear is people seeing his diagnosis and not him. He's so happy, he is so smart. Trying to take Colin to a park to enjoy swings or just to play is really hard because even though they may have an adaptive swing, the the playground has mulch and putting a wheelchair over mulch is uh, it's very difficult. So the adaptive playground that was put in at the Children's Therapy Center has been amazing because his wheelchair can go wherever it wants. He can play in the in the cave and almost be like a normal kid. He they have a merry-go-round that's adaptive and he loves to play on that. During therapy, we use it. The surface is cushioned so he can get on his hands and knees and it makes therapy go by super fast cuz he thinks he's just outside playing, but he's learning to crawl, he's learning to climb. There's animals he loves to play with. There's a big giraffe, and he likes to hug the giraffe, so part of his therapy is he'll crawl to the giraffe and pull the stand, and then he gets to hug his giraffe. There's a little water area where you push a button and water sprays out of the hippo's nose. And I mean, it's just a, it's a great place for, for him to feel like a normal kid, and not only is it therapy or working, but it's also playtime for him. And the Children's Miracle Network money has been put to great use there. I can tell you from spending a lot of time in Children's Hospital and at the Children's Therapy Center. The money that goes to this is well spent. Colin was just recently hospitalized twice and it's it's not a horrible experience. There's it is a hospital stay, but the nurses are are they treat you like family. The doctors are there to support you. Um, the money is not wasted. I'm Suzanne Miller. I'm Colin's mom. I I believe believe in in miracles. Miracles. Miracles.